What's up traders, this is VTrades and today I will be doing a technical analysis breakdown for Ethereum against the US dollar with the ticker symbol ETHUSD. This video is for entertainment purposes only and please trade at your own risk. I will first be going over what I see on the daily chart and finish the video off with the weekly chart. So Ethereum basically doing what technical analysis says it's going to do. We reached the mesh move target. All of this is one leg right here. This was the second leg and you see that the perfect mesh move target. And how do I know to use this leg as one leg? Because all of this is just one large impulse up where price saw a decent sized drop. And then from the decent sized drop started another straight leg up, which is this one right over here. All of this is one large leg and the target coincides with the top that we're currently seeing. So measuring targets met, so price was correcting. It was due for correction. Basically traders saw the measuring target and they're like, okay, well, you know, this looks like a top for a good place to take my profit target and price started dropping around that area, which is right back over here. So we saw one large drop by the bears, and now price made a correction up. So this was all this was the correction right over here. And then bears were like, okay, well the bulls can barely move up higher, so let's drop the price one more time. So that's what they're doing. So I'm looking for the 2682 to be the bottom for this drop. Is it gonna be the bottom for sure? I don't know, but it's a good place for price to reverse, and it coincides with that horizontal support at the uh, 2658 right over here from this prior high and this trend line off the swing lows. So everything is coinciding. Uh, there's some confluence right here. We have the horizontal support, we have the trend line support and the measurement target. So again, that would be the area for price to reverse off of. I wouldn't be bullish until we see a break of this trend line right here. So if we can reach those price levels and break this trend line, I'll probably leak for higher prices. This could be the bottom for the resumption of the uptrend. And then we have to just watch out for this downward trend line, um, but that would be just minor. So again, looking for more sh downside for these cryptos. Uh, I don't think this is over yet. Can it stop right here? Yes, it can, but it, uh, you know, it's, it's nothing's guaranteed, right, in the market. But again, it's very likely we're gonna see a little bit more downside. I'm looking for the mid uh, 2000, so probably the 2600 will be a good level for price to rebound off of. Now let's take a look at the weekly chart. Weekly chart shows that, you know, price found resistance at prior resistance, you know, basically like a triple top or you could say quadruple top. There was a triple top here, resistance here, 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 failed breakout, came back at the same resistance level. If it was resistance in the past, it can be a resistance in the future. After a measurement target was met, after the overextension from the EMA, this was just, you know, signaling a short area for traders or even if you're long to get out of a trade. Uh, so basically we're selling off taking back a lot of this drop that occurred in a very short amount of time If we went up very quick, we can go down very quick. So that's what's happening. You know, it's just trading uh, This is all just The chart just tells me what traders are doing. So traders, you know entered, you know around here They got out at a previous resistance level at a measure move target uh, And then we were overextended due for a pullback. We started pulling back uh, we stopped momentarily and then the bulls cannot resume that uptrend. So that tells me we could see another drop and we're seeing that another drop right now. And it's still almost over. I would say a little bit more downside, probably the mid $2,000 level, $2,600. Um, and then we could probably see the resumption, resumption, resumption of the uptrend. Is it guaranteed? No, it's not. I want to see a break of that downward trend line first. This one right here, the more steeper one. Um, so if we can see a break of that, then I think we're going to probably see resumption of the, of the uptrend. Until then, it can still continue to trend down lower and lower, but it's not likely. So that's all I have for Ethereum on the daily and weekly charts. This is VTrace, and thank you for your time.